Maya Middle Mouse button. Select an object, activate your move tool, click on an axis, it becomes active, middle mouse drag anywhere in the screen, and you can move along that axis. Activate another axis, you can do the same thing. Other way to do it, select the attribute in the attribute editor, middle mouse drag, you can see what we have here. Doesn't matter what the attribute is, it works. Click an attribute, middle mouse drag, in the viewport makes life easy. No, you don't have to click on the axis itself to move it. You can just middle mouse it from anywhere as long as it's active. You want to make all three active, click in the middle, and that'll move on all three axes. Middle mouse with snapping. Have an object, move it far away. Make sure the move tool is activated. Add another object, which by default pops up at the origin and if you hold down V and middle mouse drag it'll snap it'll point snap the new object to whatever else you wanted to point snap to that way you don't have to drag the object from the origin to get it to where you need need it to be all you got to do is hold down V and it'll snap to the object so the middle mouse button will let you do that real fast very quick way, very efficient way to work. If you have a really big set and things are way off in the distance and you just want to get an object there right away, just hold down V and snap with the middle mouse button. Translate along normal. Sometimes you want to move an object along its normal, but the move tool does not line up with the normals. Quick way to do it is hold down control and middle mouse drag, and that object is going to move along its normal. It can be a vertex. You just control middle mouse drag and it'll move along the normal. Do the same with a with an edge loop. Control middle mouse drag. It's going to move along the normal. Doesn't matter where it is. You can see that we move along the normal. Very useful tool that allows you to move things in ways that would would otherwise be difficult with the standard move tool. Extrusions. If you select a group of faces, control E to extrude, you can either just grab the blue axis and move them out to get some thickness, or you can simply middle mouse drag and it'll do the same thing. Again, control E, you'll see the thickness is active. So by middle mouse dragging it, it uses the active uh, attribute. If you want to use, say, offset, you click on it to activate it, and just like before, but what you'll notice is that sometimes it overdoes it. So what you can do is just hold down control with middle mouse drag, and it's going to slow it down so it doesn't go too fast. Okay, so hope you enjoyed those. Uh, middle mouse button is very useful part of Maya. I wish more programs would use it. Um, so, you know, have fun with that, and we'll see you in the next one.